Hello, I'm Tom Copeland, trainer, writer, advocate for the business of family child care. Welcome to this instructional video to the new Kid Care online software program. Kid Care was formerly known as Minute Menu. It's now been upgraded and is accessible from any internet platform, Mac, PC, Android, iPhone, iPad, Kindle Fire, and so on. Kid Care allows you to track all of your meals and file your food program claims electronically if your sponsor has signed up for Kid Care. It tracks children's attendance, parent payments, and payments from subsidy programs. It allows you to invoice parents via email and print out end-of-the-year parent payment receipts. This video will focus on the accounting features of Kid Care that will save you a lot of time and money on your taxes. Let's first look at how to enter a business expense into Kid Care. We'll first go into the accounting section and click on expenses. I've already entered in some expenses. Let's see how to enter in a new expense. You've just returned from a store where you've bought something. So first we'll choose the category of expense to identify the item you purchase. Now we've listed here all the expense categories that appear on your tax forms as well as additional categories and you can create some additional categories of your own. So let's say we bought something and we're calling it a supplies. We put in the date you bought it and the amount that you paid. Let's say you paid $43.67 and who did you pay it to? We've already listed some destinations, some places you might have spent money, but if you want to enter in a new uh, place that you bought money, uh, uh, where, are gonna we, where are we going to go? Ace Hardware. And what did you buy? We list some examples of expenses that might be supplies up here. And uh, we could put down, well, let's say we bought a bunch of... Uh, 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 garbage bags, can't spell, etc. Then it's going to ask you for the business percentage. Either something was 100% business, only used for your business, we can put in an actual business use percent, or we can use a time space percent, meaning uh, part of the cost is going to be deductible. We're going to add mileage because we can deduct the miles to this trip. Uh, we used a car, Mazda. Uh, we started from our home. Where did we go? We went to Ace Hardware. How many miles was it? Let's say it was six miles. It was a round trip, so now it's going to deduct 12 miles. We save this. All right, and now let's go back and look at that expense. It was supplies here we are at the bottom ace hardware forty three dollars and sixty three cents notice it calculates a thirty six percent times space percent we'll get to that in a minute for a fifteen dollar and eighty six cents deduction so now let's look more at this time space percentage issue we click on time space percentage and we click on the calculation to see how this works i've put in that we have a home of two thousand square feet and that one of those rooms was used 100% for business, and the rest of the home was regularly used for your business. And I put in that we just started uh, doing childcare this month, starting November 1st. So let's look at the calculation of this. The calculation is based on space that we're using, as well as time. And here it shows 188 hours so far in November that uh, this provider has cared for children or done other activities in her home, and there's so far 643 hours from November 1st until now. And that's how we come up with our time percent. And the formula calculates our time space percentage. So your hours can vary, the space you're using in home can be different, but once you enter in this information, this software will calculate a percentage for you that you can that will be applied to all your share expenses shared expenses and this is helpful when you're filing your tax return 
Now let's look briefly at some of the reports. We go into here reports that this software will uh, allow you to create. There's reports for children and meals and claims and so on. Let's just look at accounting reports and see we've got a whole bunch of different accounting reports. It allows you to track your meals and multiplies by the standard meal allowance. Uh, it does mileage reports. Let's just look at a Schedule C report for the 1st of November until now just to see what's in here. And you'll see it breaks down your expenses by category. So here's cleaning supplies, then supplies, then toys, then household items, then advertising. And for each category, it'll show you the expense and the business use, time, space, percent, or 100%. So under supplies, we have 100% item and we have some shared items, and it'll give us a total for supplies. So then it becomes easy to transfer this total amount, total supplies, onto your tax form. The other report let's show you is the 8829 report. 8829 is expenses associated with your house. So let's take a look at what we put in here. Here you can see mortgage interest, real estate taxes, utilities, cable television, electricity. It'll also show house repairs uh, and other house related expenses. Again, it breaks it out by time and space percentage. There's a lot more to kid care than what I've just shown you here. And if you want to see more information, you can go to the kid care website and check it out for yourself, kidcare.com. Uh, you can use it for free for 30 days, and it's $8 a month after that. To get help in using the accounting section, I, I invite you to join the Child Care Business Partnership. I provide members of the partnership with individual assistance in using kid care. I can also review your tax return and help you if you're ever audited by the IRS. For only $15 a year, you will have access to many additional instructional videos like this one, so you can take full advantage of all the kid care features. For further information about uh, this child care business partnership, go to my website, www.tomcopelandblog.com. There you can read more about the partnership and see more information about uh, many other articles that I've written on the business side of family child care. Thanks for listening.